Welcome to the Spine of Death Wing on Heroic Mode. I'm going to be showing you a pretty simple way to get this done. So you're going to see four of these corruption tentacles. You're just going to go ahead and kill three of them and keep the last one for later. At this point, you want to stand in the spot where you killed one of the corruptions and you'll have this grasping tendrils which will hold you down onto Deathwing's back because he does roll left and right. So if you're not constantly moving left or right to avoid the roll or if you're not held down by the tendril, you'll fly right off his back just like those amalgamations. You'll be killed and have to redo the whole encounter. So this point is pretty much just a waiting game. You see these corrupted bloods. They spawn from the spots where you killed the corruptions. So you're going to go ahead and wait until you're surrounded by at least nine of these corrupted bloods, as you can see here. At this point, you want to go ahead and destroy the fourth corruption tentacle. And you'll see another amalgamation spawn. You want him to get close to all the other adds and go ahead and kill the nine corrupted bloods. And at this point, you'll see him with his buff. He'll have nine stacks of this corrupted blood. At this point, you want to go ahead and kill the amalgamation. And then he'll trigger the nuclear blast, as you can see here. And then he'll pretty much explode to a nuclear effect and rip part of Deathwing's back. And then you'll see this burning tendon on the side here. You're going to go ahead and destroy that. And once you do, his back will pretty much rip off. And of course, you have to rinse and repeat this, as you see here. Again, go ahead and destroy all of the tentacles except one. Of course, go ahead and stand at the spot where you killed one of the corruptions. You, of course, will get the grasping tendrils, which will hold you down onto Deathwing's back. And it's the same thing. He's going to roll left or right. The amalgamation is going to fly right off his back. And, of course, you're just going to wait until you're surrounded by another nine corrupted bloods. At this point, it's going to be a little quicker because you have all these tentacles which you destroyed. So there's going to be more corrupted blood spawning. At this point, I was kind of stuck. I just had to use my grappling hook to get out of there. Of course, I killed that last tentacle. Another amalgamation has spawned. And then you, of course, kill the corrupted bloods while you're around with the amalgamations. He'll gain nine stacks of this corrupted blood. And then he'll do the nuclear blast once you kill him. And of course, he'll explode to a nuclear effect, rip off part of Deathwing's back. And there's another burning tendon that you will need to destroy. And of course, he'll do this three times. So... Here's the final time you do the same exact thing as you did before. Go ahead and kill this amalgamation. He will again do the nuclear blast. And at this point, you have defeated the encounter. So he blows up and then you have to destroy the final burning tendon. And just like that, you will have completed the spine of Deathwing and collect your rewards. Anyways, thanks for watching and hope to see you in the next video.